James is about to walk into an interview with Delta. He has not taken co-op class and has no job interview experience. Oh, I know this guy. We played a few games together and he kept fouling me. I can't stand this dude. I wish he would just go away. Why does he have to be the interviewer? I can't stand his face interviewing me. Why does he have to be here? I want a different interviewer or I'm out. This is no longer an interview. This is personal. I'm gonna make it harder for this guy. Alright then, so let's get started. Tell me about yourself. I'm a literal fucking goat. I'm the greatest basketball player on Cyprus. I play fair and I will foul. We're here to talk about a job interview, not basketball. So, let's get back to the interview. What are your weaknesses? Yes, mom? What was that? I left the stove on? Oh, okay, I'm sorry, mom. I love it. Oh, sorry, sorry about that. Let's just end the interview here. We'll contact you if we have any other questions. Thank you. Even though James showed up to his interview on time and wore the proper attire, he let his past drama with the interviewer affect his performance, which cost him the job. So let's go back to the beginning. Oh, I know this guy. We played a few games together and he kept fouling me. I can't stand this dude. I wish he would just go away. Why does he have to be the interviewer? I can't stand his face interviewing me. Why does he have to be here? I want a different interviewer or I'm out. James, don't let your past get in the way of your future. Be professional and mature. Good afternoon, I'm Jason. Oh, nice to see you again. Let's get started. Please tell me about yourself. Uh, I work well with others. I have great communication skills and I enjoy serving people. After taking co-op class, James understood the importance of separating his personal life from his work life and came into the interview with the proper attire and answered the questions professionally, allowing his chances of getting the job to skyrocket. Hey,